The principle of the spiral lift is best described as a continuous flat spring of stainless steel in which is inserted a vertical spiral band of stainless steel. The result is a spiral tube of successive I-shaped cross sections. The final assembly is a strong and stable column which can hold a very large load. At the center core of the spiral lift is a sprocket main plate that rotates on a thrust bearing. A sloped set of support wheels attached to the main plate lifts the horizontal band and provides space for the insertion of the vertical band. These wheels continue to provide support for the column and its load. The horizontal band is stored at the base of the assembly and the unused vertical band is stored in the rotating magazine. A chain drive turns the main plate sprocket which sustains the support wheels which lifts the horizontal band. The horizontal band is spread sufficiently in order to permit a smooth, silent and frictionless insertion of the vertical band. This process is repeated continuously until the designed height of the spiral lift is reached. The retracted height of the specific spiral lift model is relative to the length of these horizontal and vertical bands. When the sprocket's rotation is reversed, the column is disassembled with the vertical and horizontal bands returning to their original storage positions.